Hey guys, how's it going? This is Some Guy, and today I'll be at long last returning to Ren. Um, I, for those of you that are new, I've done a lot of uh, Ren reactions before, although there's still a lot to do, to be fair. And Money Game Parts 1 and 2 were heavily requested originally, um, and I think there's a Part 3 out not that long ago. So, yep, I thought I'd jump in here. If you like this video, I'll, I'll do Parts 2 and 3 uh, as well. In fact, I mean, I'll probably do them either way because I like them <laughs> generally. So, yeah, uh, I don't know much about this other than I assume it's going to be sort of political or like in some way providing a, a message is my guess. But yeah, let's jump in. <laughs> A strange time we're living in book and put fear in higher rocky parties they make us feel inferior. Probably worth noting this came out four years ago, I think. So I'm just for myself as well, I'm gonna bear that in mind with the context of when he wrote this. It's time we're living It's a strange time we're living in book and put fear in higher rocky parties they make us feel inferior. Read one straight. Parliament interiors, devils walk among us, they think the criteria eerie, they restrike, fearing, weary minded men when we're clearly living in dictatorships, nearly blinded by Sorry, I mean, I appreciate this song's meant to be about what he's saying, but the way he put that rhyme scheme together then. Theories, devil parties, they make us feel inferior. Read one straight, parliament interiors. Devils walk among us, they think the criteria eerie. They restrike, fearing, weary minded men when we're clearly living in dictatorships. Nearly blinded by illusions to choose who's fooling who. A pulled chain to your shoes, I'm pain. It's a crying shame. The pursuit of our own wealth lies a flame and makes greed the game. The less this whole war burn, as the world turns, the whole world burns. But money was invented for trade But now those bits of paper Twist hearts, make slaves Turns a saint into a sinner A child into a killer His finger on the trigger of a money game Oh Before this goes on I don't want to obviously pause too much And guess too much Before he's actually got more into it But I find it interesting what he said about um, The uh, and we're not living in a democracy, I think he was essentially applying it's, it's a dictatorship because I think money is the ruler. And it might sound like a very cynical or even untrue thing to say, but I don't think anyone can deny that in some ways it is like at least partially true. Um like, yes, we have a democracy, but you know, I'm talking about from the UK perspective, on average, it's a certain kind of person that gets into politics and makes it that far. Not always, there are exceptions. But, yeah, it's a democracy, but it's still elitist. And people don't vote, people don't engage with politics. And then the ones that are in power often, there's corruption, there's money. So yeah, interesting to hear him say that it's like, you could even say it's not even democracy. On the trigger of a money game. Oh, rain, 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 a storm it comes our way, and those who rise through distorted lines, poison in the veins, but we die to point the blame, 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 it's easy and to blame, but point the mirror at ourselves, we're all part of this old money game, stop. The vocals then were so nice, just wanted to, <laughs> to point that out. President, it's evident that everyone's a resident of fear when they support these ideas to keep us separate. When they make us believe that everybody is coming to terrorize you in the streets, they say badly through grit and teeth. That's my right to hate. That's feeling my speech. 
I mean, so many reasons why that was hard. I mean, just from a rap technique perspective, I love the the control double time. It's like very very hard to do, and then what he's saying as well, like, yeah. Despite the hate, that's freedom of speech. Let's get it. Terrorize you in the street when they support these ideas to keep us separate. When they make us believe that everybody is coming to terrorize you in the streets, they say badly through grit and teeth. That's right, the hate, that's freedom of speech. The divide and rule tactics. I think he's talking about, you know, like people hating on other people, often not actually for the reason that they should. It's in like they might have it in the UK. Someone who is on low income might uh, be struggling because they're on low income, and you know, understandably, and they might be have a negative look on on the world as a result. And they are sometimes. I feel like the government has turned their attention towards usually people not from this country that are also that have come here uh so migrant workers and managed to get them to channel their anger at, at them as that that they're the reason that they're struggling it's because they're also struggling you know and competing with them now be, you know in individual circumstances that might be the case that a, a large migrant population might you know reduce the number of jobs in a certain area but like nationally it's been shown time and time again that uh the average migrant from wherever they're from that comes to the uk is a net benefit and a significant net benefit as well to the treasury so i mean that that argument's never sort of put across though it's always like well you know you may want more tax relief or you might want more state welfare but watch out like that you know there's there's a there's a migrant there who wants to have that too um well, if i put this i'm maybe saying this badly but yeah it's that that idea of like you've got more in common with your with 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 those with with, with migrants in this example than your leaders um yeah it's and then yeah they talk about like hate they'll, they'll people who hate speeching and then you try and question it and it's well, it's freedom of speech, but I mean, that's a, that's a hard subject because it, I, I personally think there's got to be some line somewhere. But by saying that, you're already saying that there's not true free speech. But, you know, there's got to be, there's got to be a balance struck and it's it's difficult. Anyway, that's a big tangent, sorry. Um, mainly because I despair with politics in the UK. Um, and have done for years, but. Provide you in the streets, they say badly through grit and teeth, that's my right to hate, that's freedom of speech! But when did freedom become a reason to hate? A way to justify a racist slur or insult we make? There's an irony in freedom, cause us in the West, we have pillaged and put the demo that's have a just colonized all of the rest, that's called hypocrisy. Preach a certain value that you never keep yourself, your country was in flames, you denigrate yourselves in a second, still you spit your venom. Demonizing immigrants when really you're the immigrant because all of us are immigrants or dis. So I spoke too soon, and I'm <laughs> wait. I'm glad that I was in theme. Um, yeah, I mean, I could talk to I could talk for so long on on these kind of subjects, but very briefly, what what Reds are there, I love about how you know you're demonizing immigrants, but you don't think about you know where they've come from, and actually from a UK perspective. That we may well have had an impact on the country, like a very negative impact in some cases, and that might be a direct reason why they are, are now in the UK. You know, we may have caused the problem, or it was a, a former colony where there's like, you know, links there, and the fact, yeah, it's, it's it was very very quick to forget the uh, the bad things. I think, at least in the UK, probably true for a lot of, uh, um former empires if you like oh, venom, demonizing immigrants when really you're the immigrant because all of us are immigrants or descended from immigrants irony is imminent i'll shed the light on immigrants america was colonized by britain britain it was colonized by rome and also colonized by the saxons they were german by the way you know how people throw shade upon the germans because of history's pain and yet we made the same mistakes all the game demonize the whole people jewish or muslim the same and the same old situations play on repeat the same old tv Yes, I, I'm going to stop <laughs> interjecting. But this 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 subject he's talking on now is so interesting to me. But what he just said, like bang on. I, I I've said before, um, sort of in my personal life that if if I feel like if people were properly educated about human history, 
there would be so much less racism or prejudice because you'd understand that you might think that you're English, for example, you know, you, 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 your father's been here, your grandfather's been here, go back, you know, 400 years even. You know, okay, cool, but that's a drop in the ocean. You know, this, this island's been uh, inhabited for tens of thousands of years. It's been repeatedly um, migrated to. They're like, you're British, you know, uh, nurse is just it, it's a culture identity and i'm not saying that's not valuable but it's not actually rooted in a strong genetic difference and therefore different to anyone else's i mean it's it's crazy that people and probably through, through no fault of their own are quite short sighted in that regard whereas if you studied human history and human human evolution it makes it all seem a bit a bit silly in a way you know like um that people get so hung up on certain bits of land or identity and yeah anyway i'm gonna try and make that my last rant i love this by ren let's keep going TV shows repeat, yeah, we worship the bleak Our opinions aren't our own and we follow like sheep There's no left, there's no right in the middle we sleep Rain, 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 rain A storm, it comes our way And those who rise through distorted lives Poison in the veins But we'd like to point the blame, 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 blame It's easier to blame But point the mirror at ourselves We're all part of this whole money game Yeah, I've just paused quite a <laughs> actually firstly I'll say I love the cinematography here like he's not even done anything really for a minute now and yet I'm hooked you know he's it's all part of the the part it's part of the song you know the video is part of the song for Ren at least um what I was going to say though is is Ren kind of jacked there I feel like I didn't notice that before <laughs> That's, um, yeah, um, I don't know how to interpret that ending really. Like, is he talking about himself? I mean, he's, you know, he, he, he wants, he wants to kill himself, but he, he, he hates the world so much. Or maybe he's just talking about like those that can't cope with money. I don't know. It seemed, yeah, it's quite a, obviously, I know it's, it's, uh, 
um like it's all put on but like it's quite a shocking way to end it but that's ren you know he keeps me guessing um but yeah other than, i'll uh as you as you might have guessed i really like this song i like the subject um something that i personally feel quite passionate about um is in like not, not just what he did but like the, the sort of associated issues but yeah apologies if I, if I talk more than normal but you know that was my real reaction to this one um so for part two and three which i think are longer i'll try and uh rein that in a little bit <laughs> won't repeat anything i did in this one um but yeah uh like i i kind of expect it from ren now that it's going to be that kind of quality and it was very very good um so yeah keep the recommendations coming for him um and yeah i'll get to part two and three as soon as i can uh i hope you enjoyed the video please like comment if you did subscribe if you haven't already really appreciate that otherwise i'm out